This is an Embedded Systems Project by Alexander Pauly, A.J. Odenthal, and Christian Hall. Our project was to solve a Rubik's Cube. In order to completely solve a Rubik's Cube, we have to take an unsolved cube and apply turning algorithms until the cube has only one color on each face. For our project, we used a Raspberry Pi, stepper motors and controllers, a camera, and a custom-built enclosure with 3D printed parts. The Rubik's Cube we chose was a professional speed cube for easier turning and removable center sections. In order to solve the Rubik's Cube, we must first take pictures of a scrambled cube to put the colors into memory. The Raspberry Pi camera takes care of this, and we use RGB ranges to detect color correctly. Our own algorithm solves the cube in a way similar to how a beginner would. It solves the top layer first and works its way through the rest of the cube sequentially. It's important to note that each piece is unique because of the parts that it's connected to. For example, this white piece is different from this one. The algorithm recognizes the differences and knows how to move it accordingly. All moves are calculated before any movement takes place. In order to turn the cube efficiently and prevent the cube from catching on itself while turning, we made an enclosure that locks into place with pins. Here's the whole system in action. So this is an action solved. Blue one is going to first. Orange, orange is blue, orange is blue. And the last move. 